We present the case of a woman of 72 years who had a cholecystectomy in 2006. This patient came to us in January 2011 for a current biliary colic, moderate cholestasis and cholangitis. The patient had a prior magnetic resonance cholangiopancreatography with evidences of cholelithiasis filling of the common bile duct. An ERCP was performed but was unsuccessful extracting the stones. Note that the failure to remove gallstones with ERCP takes place in about 10% of interventions. The spiscope catheter was inserted into the common bile duct, allowing direct visualization of the biliary tract and the stones that were present. A thin laser probe was advanced through the 1.2 mm working channel of the spiscope catheter. Under direct cholangioscopy vision, the laser fiber was present in contact with the stones and activated, leading to their fragmentation. We use a push power gradually increased without exceeding the maximum recommended dose of 4 joules and 100 watts of power. During stone fermentation, we actively irrigated the duct with the spiscopes dedicated irrigation channels to ensure a clear field of view. The risk of complications like bleeding and perforation of the bile duct charged was constantly monitored by both cholangioscopy and under fluoroscopy. Two or three stones were completely fragmented with a few pulses. The third large 10 25 mm was reduced to coarse fragments and removed with dormia basket. A plastic stent, 10 French, 12 cm long, was placed at the end of the procedure. It is important to note that were non immediate and future complications noted. In conclusion, the use of Olmium laser with spyglass is a valid endoscopic alternative for the treatment of large stones. The aid of the spyglass system with the direct visualization of the bile ducts and stones makes the treatment safe and effective. <music>